John Cleese has hit out at BBC bosses in a fresh rant after previously accusing them of being woke and refusing to reprise Faulty Towers and Monty Python. John Cleese has launched a new rant about BBC bosses after a resurfaced article about Boris Johnson came to light on Twitter this week. The Faulty Towers star came across a 2019 tweet from David Schneider who expressed his opinion about the BBC allegedly not wanting to call the former Prime Minister a liar. Columnist Peter Oburn wrote in his The Guardian column at the time, I have talked to senior BBC executives, and they tell me they personally think it's wrong to expose lies told by a British Prime Minister because it undermines trust in British politics. Is that a reason for giving Johnson free reign to make any false claim he wants? David tweeted the quote from the article and asked, Is this really where we're at? After the tweet resurfaced on Friday, John shared his thoughts on X. Formerly known as Twitter. Writing, This demonstrates the utter gutlessness of the current BBC top brass whose only aim in life is to hang on to jobs they could get nowhere else. What destroys people's trust in politics is lying. Not pointing it out is complicity. It's not the first swipe the actor has made against the BBC in recent times. The 83-year-old has accused the corporation of giving into wokeness and ruled out a Faulty Towers and Monty Python reboot for that reason. In 2015, the actor said there was no way he would work with the BBC again, claiming editors had no idea what they're doing in an interview with Shortlist. More recently this month, John said reprising Faulty Towers on the channel wouldn't work as they would have to deal with subjects that get people upset. The actor went on to say he worked with the corporation during their best years when it was ran by people with real personality who loved the medium and they were operating out of confidence. Which was okay because there wasn't so much competition. Speaking on GB News, he went on to claim that Britain had gone from what was a middle class culture with all its failings to a tabloid culture and that is why there is so much of this screaming at people. I want to deal with subjects that get people upset but I want to get sensible people with a sense of humor who will listen to each other and who will trade arguments instead of simply making speeches. He added, in February, John announced he was making a reboot of the sitcom with his daughter Camilla in collaboration with Spinal Tap filmmaker Rob Reiner. He told fans that the forthcoming series, which will reportedly follow his character Basil struggling to navigate into the modern world after discovering he has a secret daughter, will not be an anti-woke nightmare. After some claimed the series, which ran from 1975 to 1979, should be left in the past. The actor issued a sarcastic tweet. He wrote, I must apologize. I had no idea that the idea of writing a new sitcom with my daughter would cause so much anger and distress. I truly meant no harm. Naively I thought it might be fun. But I feel terrible about having released this tide of negative emotion. Please forgive me.